S2020 savings accounts. Stay connected. Oh yeah, what's popping everyone? Welcome to my channel. My name is Peter. I'm a certified investor, personal finance enthusiast, and I'm also an IT professional. And on this channel, we talk all things investing, economy, personal finance, retirement, and of course, mindset. So make sure you like, subscribe, notification bell. That way you don't miss any of my special content, all right? And again, guys, here on Game of Finance, we're trying to bring positive change, inspire, help, learn, share ideas, growth, and good leadership. So stay safe, stay healthy, and now we'll, without further ado, let's get this work. Okay, guys, best savings accounts for 2020. So what is a savings account? Simple. A savings account is a type of bank account that enables you to earn interest on your money in exchange for limited fund access and other considerations. So keep that in mind, guys. So how do they work? Simple. Then use your funds, your savings, to fund loans to other customers. Now, these customers, they must pay back with interest what they borrow. Now, your bank passes along some of those earnings to you in form of interest. That's how it works, simple. That's what you get your APY and your compounding. Cool beans? And quick tip, guys. Online banks tends to provide higher rates than traditional conventional banks. They are able to do this because they have fewer overhead costs, which is huge. That's why we get the higher APY. Cool beans? So regarding the specific of the, um, the accounts, well, I was able to analyze many factors such as the APY, no fees, minimum balances, and range of availability. Also, keep in mind, I got you. All of the accounts that I'm about to show you, they are all insured by the FDIC, period. There's no way it makes no sense you put in your hard-earned money into a savings account that has no protection. It's just nonsense. I got you on that part. All of the accounts are protected by the FDIC. Okay, guys, I'm going to try my best to coach you, and hopefully you can become a chess master when it comes to comparing savings accounts so please follow along okay all right guys let's begin for essentials and fundamental when it comes to comparing savings accounts or checking accounts and whatnot i'm gonna show you right here on the board so grab your pen and paper all right let's go opening right here the first one that you need to make sure is you need to shop around and see what fits you and meets your need that's key you need to shop around guys you need to and this is right here the savings account checklist this you need to look at all these things period you gotta check mark all of them right there minimum balance compare interest rates promo and short term to make sure that if you get you know uh you know uh, five percent you know interest rates make sure that it's actually it's, you know, it's going to be variable, but that it's not going to be a short term, you know, some sort of an introductory for new clients and things like that. So this one, make sure that you keep that in mind. Make sure that you don't fall into that little trap. The other one, fees and factors, definitely. Security, I already told you, all the accounts are FDIC protected. You have to. Features, customer service, it says, you know, one day a week, is it five days, is it seven days? Online banking, is it user-friendly? Mobile, you know, the app, whether, you know, Android or iOS, you know, for the Apple. Does it, do they offer free checking? And again, easy access. So you have to keep those in mind. All this checklist right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven checklist right there all right so make sure you keep that in mind let's continue another essential make sure you keep an eye oh it's what we say back home watch out keep an eye for it oh check it out opening account how much you need to open that account balance 
and the minimum that you must have to earn the APY. Example, if the APY is 2.5 for $100 and you have on your account 50, you're not gonna be able to earn that 2.5. You're probably gonna earn less, maybe 1% or maybe, you know, a 0.90, something like that. So it all depends. So you need to follow that policy right there to make sure that you fall under the hundred dollars for you to be able to enjoy the 2.5. So if they say the minimum is a hundred for you to gain and have that uh, compound interest, then that means that you need to follow that way you can be able to increase that savings account. No, no, no. So make sure you keep an eye. And guys, now touching base the security side, which is major key. All right, let's take a look right here. We have a few entities involved in this uh, uh, savings account. Let's begin with the NCUA, the National Credit Union Administration, right? The second one is the CFPB, the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau. And this is the one that most people are most uh, you know familiar with. You'll see it on the website. You'll see the logo on the bottom um, you know, of the screen. The FDIC, the Federal Deposit Insurance Corp. This one is maybe the key, guys. You need to have the FDIC on your account. You cannot be putting money with no protection. This makes no sense, you know? Uh, so those are the three, NCUA, the CFPB, and the FDIC, major key on those, all right? Quick tip, for the FDIC, the Federal Deposit Insurance Corp, it was established on 1933. Why? Due to the Great Depression, all the banks were, you know, they were failing, so they decided to introduce the FDIC to avoid this huge discrepancy in the future. So protect the banks and protection for all the consumers. So major key, keep an eye on this right here. Make sure that your money is protected and safe, all right? Long. All right. So let's focus here. Yeah. Goals and considerations. Well, let's begin with the considerations right here. The Federal Reserve interest rate that's why you have seen right now some of the interest rate were not what they used to be at the beginning of the year which were really really good and we had it good right now because of the correction the economy fluctuation the interest rate have you know they dropped big time so keep an eye on this you need to learn about that the interest rate from a federal federal standpoint also now Moving along to the goals, you might have one reason or you might have many reasons why you want to open a savings account. Well, emergency fund, you must have an emergency fund. Right now, it's proof. You must have an emergency fund for a rainy day, maybe health, any discrepancy. So, major key, emergency fund. The next one, as far as the goal, the reasons, well, child education, Maybe purchase a house, you know, maybe you want to purchase a boat, you know, anything like that. All this right here, down payment, you know, similar with, with, with the with purchasing a home. Maybe you're looking for some, you know, move to the Caribbean and they want to have two homes. Well, that's another reason right there. And again, if we, you know, planning for future, you know, for your kids, your college, again, that's another one. So. There are many, many reasons to be open in a savings accounts. So it's all up to you and your staff. So now for the next part, you know, we're gonna focus on the types of savings accounts. People might just think, hey, they chose one, there's only one, you know, bank that can only, you know, offer savings accounts. No, 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 no. There are many financial institutions that can actually be able to open savings accounts. But we're gonna keep it very simple. Now, another quick tip, you know, we have banking since, my goodness, the 1799 and the savings accounts, 1816. So they've been around a really, really, really long time, guys. So they, they, they know the deal. They know the math. They know how this business works. So now continue on with the, that was the, the quick tip. 
Now moving along to the types. Well, we have the individual, which is the most familiar one. They have the joint. They have the payable on death, the POD. You have seen those. And the UTMA or the UGMA. This one is actually, this is the actual name for the acronym. Uniforms Miners Act. They have two. They have the UTMA, which focus on the transfer, and the UGMA, which focus on as a, you know, as a gift for the Miners Act. So those are the four types. We're gonna keep it simple because those even, if we go each, it's gonna take us a really, really long time. So let's just keep it simple. We have right there individual, joint, POD, UTMA, and UGMA, all right? Jumping right in guys to number one. Again, online banking. This right here, what I'm gonna show you. Let's begin with Ally Bank. Headquarters, Utah, established in 2004. What we like about this particular bank, well, they offer a high APY, and they have a 24 seven customer service, which you know, what type of product do they offer? That is huge. They have savings accounts, checking, credit cards, money markets, IRA loans, DIY investments for all the investment lovers and managed portfolio. So it's huge guys. This bank is, has some many, many products to offer. Top perks, well, let's begin. High rate. 1.10% still high. You know, if you compare to the national rate, huge difference. Now you'll see no minimum deposit, no minimum balance, and key compounded daily. That AP that APY 1.10% is compounded daily. Like, that's huge. Not every bank actually is able to offer that to the to their uh, clients. So key now because this is a, an on, online banking they don't have branches so they offer the e-check you take you, you know you download the app take pictures back and front you'll be able to send that electronically so very di diverse products guys so keep an eye like bank go study do your homework okay next moving along discover bank Headquarters, Illinois, it was established in 1986. What we like about this particular banking? Well, good range of goods and high rates. Again, they do offer high rates. If you compare it to the national uh, rates for the traditional banking, huge difference. Products they offer are not so diverse. They have the checking, savings, money market, CDs, IRA, they have student loans, home loans, personal loans, and other diverse products um, banking. Top perks, well, the high rate, 1.01% APY, no monthly balance, an amazing mobile app, no minimum deposit, no fees, and they also offer the FICO score for free. Very accessible and easy. Major key, all right? So take a look out, do your homework, discover back. All right, move on to the next one. American Express, they are another one that has been around big time, guys. Headquarters, NY, established 1850. Use, they, they know the deal. I mean, you must know or heard of something about American Express. Come on, guys. So, what we like, I rate, again, longevity, trusted company, and they also have a 24-7 customer service. It's always good to have the customer service, guys. And they say just having, hey, we only have customer service on Wednesday. You know, that, that really sucks. So, products they offer, well, here we go. Savings credit cards, prepaid cards, corporation programs, and business credit cards. So the American Express is a little more specific and exclusive on certain things. So, uh, you know, if you're looking for credit cards and savings accounts, prepaid cards, 
then you you know you you should be able to dig deeper into American Express. Okay. Top perks: IAPY, one point zero zero percent, no fees, no minimum deposit, which is good. No minimum balance, and also they offer the free credit score report so you're able to see it there and it's very accessible it's free it's a plus you have it there for free accessible you'll be able to look it up if you're interested go ahead go check out american express okay cool beans guys now moving along next marcus omen sack another classic also on the investment side headquarters and why established 1869. What we like about this, uh, you know, about this particular account again, high rate, another plus, 24 7 customer service. What are the, some of the products they offer? Simple. Savings account, CDs, we have right here, this one, debt, and credit card consolidation. If you're looking for those uh, particular features, you know, that's a plus right there for Goldman Sachs. You know, go check it out, do your homework. Again, also, they have diverse loans. Another reason for you to, you know, if you're looking for loans, go ahead, ask some questions and check it out to see if they meet your needs. Now, top perks they have, which is, it, it, it is very interesting. This is gonna become very competitive soon. Same day transfer, some bank, they still have this, you know, they take two weeks, a week, some of them are pretty good. They have, you know, they take maybe like three days, but this one actually offers the same day transfer, which is awesome. No fees. You're able to link multiple accounts, which is another awesome feature. You, it's a must have. No minimum deposit. And again, high APY, 1.05%. Another huge plug. So if you're looking for any of those, of those particular features we'll check out uh, Marcus Goldman Sachs okay guys cool beans all right guys last but not least Capital One now the monster headquarters VA established 1994 what we like about Capital One let's see diverse product line awesome and this way I rate products they offer well check it out they have the 360 savings account pretty awesome credit card checking the IRA for your retirement auto loans they have the kit savings CDs and then again guys the free credit score report top perks let's see APY 1.00% they have an awesome mobile app no fees no minimum deposit, again, the, the FICO score, and the minimum balance is just, guys, $1. Come on, you gotta have at least $1 in your savings account to get to earn that APY, come on. So, Capital One, these are all the perks. Again, APY, you got your minimum deposit, FICO score, minimum balance, so all the goodies. So guys, if you looking for those particular perks, then go ahead and check out Capital One's Cool Beans. All right, guys, those are my top five savings accounts. Ally Bank, Discover Bank, American Express, Marcus Goldman Sachs, and Capital One. Guys, the key, the feature, and have balance on your savings accounts. There's a possibility you're gonna find higher rates, but the features are lacking. You need and you want balance, so you can take advantage of any changes now or in the future okay so keep an eye those are my top five all right cool beans bonus tip options to consider besides the savings accounts well you have certificate deposit the cds the money market accounts and the checking accounts these are accounts that you can actually put to work also in conjunction with your savings accounts yes. also i want to give you bonus tips as far as the qualification and the definition let's go, go here real quick APY, what, does, what, what is the definition? Well, it takes into account how often interest compounds. That's why APY is key. You saw them here for all five of the banking. 
liquidity this is key also this refers to how easy it is to turn your money into cash that's why liquidity means guys so those were some of the bonuses hi right, guys food for thought savings accounts well savings accounts guys is is one of the few and many ways for you to put your money to work without risking and of course my suggestion is always to be diverse this is why we point out here remember savings accounts they have different tactics and goals we addressed it right here you know that's 2020 savings accounts if you are interested go check them out and study my top five savings accounts i draw you here a little piggy bank so you can get fired up then again make sure you go back to the video check out the checklist to make sure that you cover all your bases okay all right guys hope you find this content valuable again please practice due diligence you gotta do your homework all right if you have any questions any comments please place them down below also i wanted to share please grab my prime guy investing one-on-one go ahead submit your name email i will take you straight to the download link it's free so you guys get have no excuse period also for my latin spanish people i got you go ahead de la misma forma nombre correo electrónico sometan los llevará al sitio web y ahí podrán bajar la guía de estudio completamente gratis so no hay excusa okay so make sure you grab it before you go you guys and this should be second nature by now like subscribe comment notification bell that's the call of duty formula right there all right okay guys that's it for this session i appreciate your time thank you for watching i hope you have a great day and i'll see you guys in the next chapter okay work hard work smart i'm out